So in the third question of this fourth exercise, we have been given a few set of statements and we'll have to determine whether which of the following statements are true. So the first of these statements is whether a cube can cast a shadow in shape of a rectangle. And the second one is whether a cube can cast a shadow in the shape of a hexagon. So to understand this, let us consider a cube which is placed under a lamp as we can see here in this particular figure. Now, since the lamp is present here, so the shadow will be cast in this direction. So let us see what happens when we cast the shadow of this cube. So as we can see here, when we have considered the shadow of the cube, we see that the shape of the shadow represents the shadow of a rectangle and not a hexagon. So to answer this question, we can say that the first statement is true and the second statement is false. So this is how we are going to answer the third question of this exercise. To know more about how QMath can help you become a master of math, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program taught by highly experienced and committed teachers.